Hi everyone, this is Pampered Chef Recipes. My name is Kay and I'm an independent consultant for Pampered Chef. Today, we're going to be making mocha braised short ribs in the Rock Crock Dutch Oven. Our featured product for today is the Rock Crock Dutch Oven. Comes with a glass lid and it is four quarts on the inside. The ingredients you'll need for this recipe are canola oil, beef short ribs, salt and pepper, onion, garlic, chipotle peppers in adobo sauce, brown sugar, flour, ground cumin, coffee, tomato sauce, beef stock, and bittersweet chocolate chips. This recipe came as a recipe card with the Dutch oven when I got it. I've cut the recipe in half. It normally serves eight and I only have two people in my family. So we're gonna start with just two and a half pounds of short ribs. And I'm gonna cut them into smaller pieces. While you're doing all these pre-steps, make sure to preheat your oven to 325. Heat your canola oil over medium-high heat. Once the oil has kind of a shimmer to it, you'll add your meat to the pan. This is your time to season it with salt and pepper. While your beef is searing, now is your chance to chop up your chipotle peppers as well as your onion. That was way less work than chopping it all with a knife. While the beef's finishing up, we're gonna add our garlic to the onion and peppers. Once your beef is all browned, take it out of the pot and pour off the drippings. I'm gonna add a half tablespoon of the drippings back to the pan. As well as your onion, garlic, and peppers. The brown sugar, flour, and cumin. And then stir it all up, mix it up good for about two minutes. Once that's all stirred together, you will add your coffee, your stock, and your tomatoes. Once you've got it all added in, cook it until it comes to a simmer. Once it's come to a simmer and started to blend all together, we're gonna turn off the heat and add the ribs back in. Now we cover it and 
put it in the oven and for two hours and 15 minutes or until the meat falls off the bone. Two hours and 15 minutes is almost up and the house smells delicious. Can't wait to see how it looks when it comes out of the oven. There are two more steps. We have to remove the meat from the Dutch oven and then skim off the fat and still have to add our chocolate. So the next step is to get the meat out of there. Gotten the meat out and skimmed some of the fat off the top. Now we're going to add our few ounces of chocolate in and stir until it's all melted. So there's your finished mocha sauce, ready to go over the ribs. Well, here we are. Smells really good. Kind of spicy, kind of chocolatey. Can't wait to give it a try tonight at dinner. Till next time, thanks for watching.